people burn wood in their homes for heat and ambiance during the cold months. The smell of burning wood is even pleasant to some people, but even though wood is a natural substance, exposure to wood smoke can be hazardous to one's health. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency reports that smoke from wood burning is made up of a complex mixture of gases and fine particles, also called particle pollution, particulate matter, or PM. In addition to particle pollution, wood smoke contains several toxic harmful air pollutants, including benzene, formaldehyde, acrolein, and polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons. Carbon monoxide is also produced during the burning of wood. These substances and microscopic particles can get into the eyes and respiratory system, where they can cause health problems. The EPA states that short-term exposures to particles from wood smoke can aggravate lung disease, causing asthma attacks and acute bronchitis, and may also increase susceptibility to respiratory infections. Long-term exposures have been associated with problems such as reduced lung function and the development of chronic bronchitis and even premature death. Some studies also suggest that long-term exposures to very fine particle pollution may be linked to cancer and to harmful developmental and reproductive effects, such as infant mortality and low birth weight. The EPA reports that wood smoke can affect everyone, but children, teenagers, older adults, people with lung diseases, including asthma and COPD, or people with heart diseases are the most vulnerable. Research indicates that obesity or diabetes may also increase risk. These are just a few things to know about wood smoke exposure and your health. To learn more about this or other air quality, environmental, health, safety, or occupational issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.